this brand. Internal server error, yeah. Turn. I'm going to do something very similar down here. DB.save. Error. <coughs> right? Yeah, same thing. Alright, let's try it. Uh, undefined HTTP internal server, oh, status internal server error. What else? I dot db capital S. Nice, build successful. So that still works. What fields do we have in the list? Name. We don't need to run that anymore. Uh, I think it's post. Um, I'm not sure what you mean. I don't think other developers make developers use Linux. What's the... Hmm. So live in D is for data. What is it, L? So why do you think other developers make people use Linux? Oh, it's capital X. See, I was really close. Um, bad content type. Okay. So I use Linux because all of my software runs on Linux, and because. Um, all the server software I need so like if I need Apache or something it runs on Linux and because I'm also I also do system administration stuff so knowing my way around Linux was always a good thing to do um, so I started using Linux I don't know seven years ago eight I don't know as my main desktop OS and then why would I ever switch I do have a Windows partition that's very small for games and stuff, but most of the games are now coming out on Linux, so I don't even need to use it. I haven't booted into it in a very long time. Alright, so, by content type. What is this expecting? So, what is that? Um, it's expecting. Oh, strange. Yeah, I mean, I was 
Steam just made an announcement the other day that there's a bunch of games coming to Linux, like the new Batman game and things like that. So, I mean, even if I thought about switching, uh, it just is never worth it to me. So it looks like it wants this JSON format in, which is fine. Um, gonna put single quotes around there or else you're gonna have a bad time. I have a Mac, it, it sits there. I haven't used it in forever. The only time I ever use my Mac is when I'm forced to do... Oh, look, that inserted. Nice. The only time I ever use my Mac is when I have to do iOS stuff. And luckily, that's not all the time. It's like twice a year. <laughs> I can agree with the price tag. Like, I don't like the price tag either. Although, it's, it's not ridiculously expensive, and it's yet usually a better build quality but I mean I don't know I used to have like a hundred different like config things that I would do as soon as I got a new Mac because all the defaults are now crazy I really just wanted to be like what it was three versions ago all right so now we need to be able to update yeah I can't click on that Then we need to be able to do a put. So put. You can believe whatever you want about why the price tag is so much, but there's a reason why Apple has billions of dollars in profit. It's not because they have to have their price it's because setting something expensive makes you feel like it's an item you want to own it's a mental thing just like a Ferrari doesn't cost uh, or a Bugatti doesn't cost 2.2 .2 million dollars to make but people still buy them because it's a status thing So this one I need to basically get the list. So I need the path param ID. Oh, I didn't even know it did that. That's super useful. And then yeah <laughs> what's so cool shy shy so dot first so basically if it's fair is not equal to nil then we'll do rest dot not found which we have up here Yes, Darwin is based on Unix, which, you know. All right, so remove this stuff. So we'll have an updated list if so here's this is basically the list of um, 
everything that was posted to update because not everything has to be posted. So what fields do we want to allow to be updated? Probably just the name on the list. Because the rest is system stuff. Actually we want list.name equals updated.name. And then anything else they post we don't actually care about. So now we need to update it. So that'll be if er i dot d b q. It's a Big Mac eighty five. Ah, not equal to nil. Wow, that was a unfortunate series there. So that should be good. So we just created list number three, which set the wrong created on, but it's all right, I guess. So API list three, build was successful. Uh, we need to change this to put. Nice. So then we get the updated list returned. Now we need to be able to delete it. We're gonna have to do permissions around all these eventually. Copying all that. I mean, I'm not rewriting all that. We need the ID, which will be a path parameter. Uh, it's going to be list. Hmm. So we need to find it. If we found it, we can delete. Yeah. We went, oh, internal server error. no longer exists at that point. <laughs> Alright. Let's try it out. Delete. Yeah, so let's delete number three. Nice, it returned a 200 OK and it performed the delete. So we got cred for that.